I'm uh, Gary Johnson. I'm here at the Aurora Public Library. Uh, I have an exhibit of some of my photographs, which I've taken in different parts of the world. Um, I'm hoping that uh, when you come to the library and you see these uh, pieces of uh, art, that uh, you'll get something out of it. Um, uh, what I've done is I've applied uh, a bit of verse. Uh, I do write poetry as well. So when you come and you have a, a look at the pieces and you see what the way I interpret it, uh, then uh, maybe you'll take something away and, and give your own interpretation. I started out, um, well, I, I wanted to go to Ryerson and take radio and television arts. And um, at the outset, all I wanted to do was to be a radio personality. <laughs> and uh, so what happened or developed over time is that I started getting involved in film and television production as well. So over time, I produced those motion picture films. Then it became video after that because at the time, the, there was a transition from film to video. And uh, so I did more of that. Um, but you apply the same principles uh, to um, motion picture as you would to still photography. It's about the light, uh, the ambiance, the, the, the color, um, the juxtaposition of things, it all comes into play. Um, and so there is a real transference of uh, motion picture, still photography. They're interrelated and, and the same principles apply. Uh, the way I go about uh, um, doing my photography is that uh, I uh, travel the back lanes and I, 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 I like to travel as well uh, around the world uh, if I possibly can because it's a real perk to be able to do that. Um, but I look for the, um, oh, what shall I say, not the um, most tourist-oriented uh, uh, places. I look for the back lanes, things that will, I can find that will give me color. Um, I, have a, I think every artist has an eye, um, an eye for what they like, um, and that's what they produce and give to the, uh, uh, the, the gallery public. Uh, these are uh, three pieces I put together. Um, and I've called them Mercury flyby to give the impression that we're uh, flying over the planet of Mercury. This is what you're seeing on the surface of Mercury. But the little story that goes behind this is that uh, this is really taken of a Mercury truck, an old pickup. And it's just the, the rust and the variation of colors that this vehicle has aged and left behind. Uh, this particular piece um, I shot in Cuba. I was on a tour and um, they took us into this, what I call a grotto. It's an underground cave and um, the light coming fr uh, from up above uh, as you got further down shone on this water and um, I just loved the rippling effects that it had and I, I was able to capture the light from up above and there was enough light to actually uh, create, allow for this picture. It almost sends a, a, a chill up your back that you've got the shot that you wanted and you think it'll be good. So that's, uh, I mean, it, it, it kind of reinforces why you do what you do, uh, that you get that thrill out of, of getting a good shot. Yeah.